Greetings YouTube. It's Wednesday, March 16th. And here's what I got for you today. First thing I want to show you is they've released pictures of the dark side of the moon now. There it is. And there's a couple interesting features in some of the craters here. Like right over here. See this right here? This is a strange square-like feature right here. All right, moving on. I want to show you a magnetos excuse me, yeah, a magnetosphere sim from the 11th. We were hit by this earthquake. I don't know if the time frames match up yet, but on the 11th we took a big hit here. You're going to see it on the bull shield in a minute. Look at that. Crazy activity there on the 11th. Could it be related to the earthquake? Okay, and then at Soho, we're missing some data here. You can see we go from 15, the next step, the next frame. Right there, we lose about six hours. And it's on the Lasco C2 as well. Slightly different time frame, but we still lose about six hours here. See, we go from the 15th to the 16th. Just like that. So, uh, and the last thing I wanted to show you is this article on the Large Hadron Collider. They're pretty much confirming that this is a time machine now. And you can, I'll have this typed in my video description so you can read up on it, but we know they're not smashing atoms up there. Them boys are messing around with time. And this Michio Kaku, the scientist we've been seeing on television, I believe this gentleman is from the future myself. So, stay tuned, people. I'll have another link here about the Singularity Network. They have a lot of new information on upcoming technologies, and they're saying the Singularity is coming, people. Before you know it, I mean, we're going to be walking cyborgs.